Um, we have some really great workplace goss. Workplace goss. Uh, for you. Okay. So here you go. Hmm. Hey, an Italian hospital worker reportedly took home nearly 650,000 fazools Whoa. despite skipping work for <laughs> over 15 years. That's Whoa. a lot of pizza dough. Hey, Salvatore, <laughs> suck my eyes. Wait, suck my eyes? Suck me? Suck me? <laughs> Scumachi, Scumachi. Excuse me. Pardon, pardon, pardon. He's from the other side of Italy. Scumachi, 66. I reported them been assigned to work in the Fire Emergency Operations Center. Okay, all right, okay. All right. <laughs> he was working uh, in was the working. Fire Emergency Operations Center of the Puglesi Cicchiaccio Hospital in the city of Cantarsaro, Calabria, in Italy. You know I went saying? to school there. So that's familiar. Yeah. I went to school. There's a McDonald's right on the corner by the Fire Emergency Operations Center. So this is Yo. very near and dear to my heart. Shout out to my man getting sick 50. Yeah. Okay. Wow. 650 bands. That's a, that's that's a real brilliant. PPP loan. You know what I'm saying? And skipping work for 15 <laughs> years. Hey, that's a hey. salute. You know what Salute I'm saying? that man. You know what I mean? That's what they call in the, uh, in the mafia a no-show union job. You know, his wife was like, Sal, are you going to work? He's like, why? The money still comes in. Get off my back. <laughs> Somebody in Italy is watching this. It's like, uh, we don't talk like this. Why did they talk like this? <laughs> so well, because everybody in Mars Park does. That's what it is. Does he have to give the money back? No, probably. Probably not. Like, I don't yeah. know. The rules, are, I feel like the rules are different in Italy. Like, they smoke everywhere. They drink wine for breakfast. Like, it's, they're just like, out there wilding. He's being investigated. He's being like, investigated. Where's, Sal, where's the money? He's like, I stand it on Zeppelis. He just got a, a sneaker wall full of Zeppelis behind him. Like, yo. I mean, if he has to give the money back, like, how's he going to do that? He probably already spent it on, like, you know. Is, is, like, Versace, like, you know, Old Navy in Italy? I always wondered that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Since it's, like, just they just make it there, they just crank it out. I think it's still expensive. <laughs> and then to get to him, they're going to have to, like, stomp on some mushrooms, beat King Bowser, hop yeah. on a flagpole to it's get into the oh castle. Oh, my God. Because that's how life is in Italy. It's Super Mario Brothers. It's wild. It's mm -hmm. wild. You just you and your brother. You know what I mean? Um. Well, speaking of buns... Uh, Whoa! Hey, the new cheeseburger is <laughs> hey. at Chargers and Rams games for this upcoming season. It is what we like to call a gentrified chopped cheese. Just a sad yes. chopped cheese sandwich. This is not from a bodega. This is from no. like a bodega Andrew Yang went to. As you can see, there's yes. no cats involved. <laughs> no. This is, that looks like American cheese. They probably took it out the plastic. Yes. Uh, look at that. You can this see at no time sad. was an angry man chopping the meat while giving you this grunt with advice in the bodega while probably using hands that smell like Newports because he didn't wash them after coming out from smoking a bogey. This is not a good... You love it. not... A good chopped cheese. And is that a nah, hot this dog is trash. Yo, listen. Football games are like six hours long. You know what I'm saying? Imagine eating this and like subjecting your bowels to that and have and sitting through a football game. Have you ever taken a shit in a football stadium? Uh, no, I was raised right. I would never do that. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> like, you don't want to do that. <laughs> so, listen. Unless you got a how chamber they, pot. How much are they charging for this? It looks like $13. Uh, they haven't released prices It looks like yet. $13. I've been paying a lot for chopped cheeses now as they're getting gentrified. You people need to stop. Chopped cheeses should not be more than $5. Five seventy-five if you add extras, like extra cheese or extra meats. You know, you know the vibes. Okay, we have some right-wing goss. Right-wing goss, right-wing goss. <laughs> Yo. Yo, Ben Shapiro, uh. ridiculed on Twitter for video buying plank of protest wood at Home Depot. Shout out to you, man. To own the libs, he went to Home Depot and said, let me get one wood. Just one wood. All right, as you can see, I just went shopping at Home Depot. You should do the same. This wood, this board, this magnificent piece of poplar is now mine. Julia, I don't want you getting too horny, but he's definitely rocking the pants like Papa John. Like, just... Oh, yeah. <laughs> those, yo, man, those hems are dragging on the floor. <laughs> Wow! Look, they he looks like he—he oh he looks like he's never been to Home Depot. He's never touched a tool. He's never touched what? Like my man. You know he's never been. You never been. You know he's never been a fucking Home Depot because he tried to put a two by four in a plastic bag. You know the people out at Home Depot was like, "No, my man, really? You putting a bag on this?" Like, meanwhile, you see day laborers just leaving with like four four by fours on their back, like, "Yo, what up?" You know what I mean? Around. Like Nothing. 38, 30 sheets of sheetrock, like, "Yo." <laughs> Throwing the back of the pickup, like you know he has on some Chelsea boots. Look how he's standing. He's you know ready. it. You know and it. He got the receipt up like he's walking out of Walmart, and they were checking. Like, yo, I gotta see that before you leave, bro. Yeah, yeah. Buy? Look, I bought, I bought a wood. I bought one wood. I'm I gonna stand on top of it to be a tall boy. The sad part, his wife called and was like, "What are you doing?" He was like, "I just got some wood." She's like, "Hurry home. It's been a long time." Yeah. Uh, 
Come get some of this dap. This ended so many liberals because like, oh, he got the wood. So. Oh, hey. Hey. Yo, congrats, little man, little Benny. And then Twitter did what Twitter does. Libs destroyed by man supporting Home Depot, who inadvertently proves he never goes to Home Depot. Shout out to Prison Planet, who has been struggling to be not only a right wing mainstream person on Twitter, but also to make his facial hair connect. Yes, and as yes. You see, it's not happening. But when Prison Planet has to dunk on Ben Shapiro, it's a good day for the rest of the world because that means yes. the rats are eating each other. We have uh, more right wing. Terrible news. Uh, oh, busted. Bring it on, Bumble. Capital Riot suspect arrested after prospective date turns him into police. First of all, storming the Capitol is not cool shit. Like, that doesn't fall under the category of cool shit. Like, yo, I beat LeBron one-on-one. -on -one. Maybe you could bring up during a date. Those, but... side, those sideburns are cool shit. Look at that right there, bro. <laughs> Look at that. That's those a are choice, mind too. Chops. That is a choice. And he was like, yo, I'm going to have all these MAGA broads hot and bothered, bro. Also, he like led with. He was like, "Yo, bro, I went. To, I stormed the Capitol. Let me storm them cheeks." You're. I did storm the Capitol. I made it all the way into the Sanctuary Hall. Did an interview with Robert Umaro of the Washington Post. Also, did some online interviews with Jess Bevins of the Wall Street Journal. And she was like, "We are not a match." And he mm. said, "I suppose not." But he didn't mm. realize that she had the FBI on the other line. Like, yo, this guy. I don't even care about the Capitol shit. It's the it's the sideburns. <laughs> That's the yeah. most egregious part of yeah. it. Yeah. Like, bro, you trying to look like motherfucking Wolverine dog is not working. It's and he's doing not that working. thing, guys doing photos with like, they smize like that and they think they look sexy, but he just looks like he has had ta bad tacos or some shit. And he's yeah. gassy. It's not he's sexy. He's holding something. Guy. Nah. Mm -mm. You look like you're thinking about farting, but you can't because you're in an Uber pool. Wait, is that a smize he's fucking trying to do? A, gu a guy's? He's trying to do a smize. He's trying to do yeah. a mega smize. A mega yeah. smize. You oh, can't do too smile. much smize because then you're over here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You start getting so we're gender politics. But he's like, yo, yeah. he clearly watched Next Top Model. He learned from Tyra how to smize. Mm -hmm. So he's doing mm -hmm. his best yeah. right here. He's going or to the next smiling. round. Can you guys He could smile? be smiling. You know what I mean? Maybe scowling. You smile, but you need, you, know, you need an authentic smize. You can't just force yourself to smize. You have to smize. But smizing is very important now because people wear masks. So that's how you smile now, by smizing. Mm -hmm. Miro, is that your smize? I'm, that I'm like, I've never smized. Is it working? No. Thanks. Get this guy out of here. Bro, you, you, like, everybody that went to this thing looks like they smelled terrible. I don't even have to allegedly that. All right. Are you guys ready for, to start the show? Let's start the show, bro. We got a show? Yo, welcome to the Jesus and Mero YouTube channel. That's right, you know what I'm saying? Like, subscribe, you know what I mean? That's right, we got a lot of digital content in here to keep you up in between our shows. So be sure to like, subscribe, and you know, click watch another video. We out. Hit all the players, watch man videos, holla.